So what is this uh, mechanistic interpretability thing? Sure. So this is a annoyingly fuzzy question. The starting point I'd go with is with an analogy to rever reverse engineering a compiled program binary to its source code. Neural networks are this thing that emerges from weird processes like stochastic gradient descent that learned a bunch of parameters that let it do a task competently. We have no idea how it works, and I want to be able to understand what it has actually learned and why it does what it does, but I'm holding myself to the extremely high standard of I want to actually understand what the internal cognition of the system is. Like, what are the algorithms it's running such that it takes the inputs, produces a series of intermediate things, and then produces some legible output? So now that we know what, uh, what you mean by this mechanistic interpretability thing, why do you do it? What's the point? So on a purely personal level, it's just really fun. And that actually does carry quite a lot of weight for me. I also think it's actually very important. So at a high level, I think we're living in a world where we're going to get computer programs that are human-level intelligent or beyond that are doing things, and that it's plausibly going to be pretty hard to tell whether these things are doing things because they're actually aligned or because they're learned to be deceptive or to exploit flaws in the training process or just are actually trying to be aligned but have mislearned some things okay. and i would really prefer to live in a world where we actually understand these things hmm. and i think that mechanistic interpretability is not obviously the only path to get to a point where we can make some claim to understand systems but i think it's a promising path that to me achieves a pretty high level of rigor and reliability and understanding. I also think that neural networks are a really complex system, and it's really hard to make progress in a complex system without any grounding of something you actually understand that you can build off of. And I just think that lots of things we're confused about in networks, where they're just in ML as a whole, in alignment, just kind of like anything you might care about, I expect it will get easier the more we can claim that we actually understand what's going on inside these models. Sure. I also think it's kind of scientifically fascinating. <laughs>